for this problem, what we have is we have two angles, oh, I'm sorry, two lines. Uh, they're parallel with each other, so I'll make them parallel. Or I'll at least represent them parallel. And then we also have a transversal. So when we have two parallel lines and transversal, a lot, a lot of special, special things happen, all right? And so what we're gonna do is we're gonna look at these two and say, well, what's so special, what's happening? Well, there's a couple things. We have same side, um, interior, add up to equal 180. Um, alternate interior angles uh, are equal to each other. Alternate exterior angles are equal to each other. And what was the other? And corresponding angles are equal to each other. So if you kind of forgot all those angles, I'm gonna work on alternate exterior and interior to show you what those look like. Um, because I have a couple other videos on explaining what all the angles are. But to solve this problem, um, what I would notice is these are alternating exterior angles. The reason why I know they're alternating exterior angles is they're alternating on which side of the transversal they're on. One is above it and one is below it. Then from there, you can say both are exterior, they're both outside of my parallel lines. Hence, they're alternating interior ang or alternating exterior angles. Another way to look at this is you can also say that these are vertical angles, these two angles, and these two are vertical angles. All right, and alternate interior angles are pretty easy for students to remember. So maybe if you just use the theorem of vertical angles, you would see that these two are vertical, these two are vertical, so they're equal to each other. Then you know that 104 is equal to these two because these are both alternating, again, the transversal, but they're both inside the parallel lines. Either way you want to look at it, we're going to have the equation x minus 10 is equal to 104. So then to solve for x, I'll add a 10 on both sides, and x equals 114. And that's how you solve this problem.